In God we trust, all others must bring data. Rightly said by W. Edwards Deming. In a world increasingly driven by technology, this quote has never rung more true. Every click, swipe, purchase or interaction in the digital realm leaves behind a trail. That's data. With the explosion of this data comes opportunity to understand human behavior, predict trends, optimize businesses decision and solve complex real world problems. At the heart of this transformation lies data science, which is a multidisciplinary field that extracts meaningful insights from raw data using techniques rooted in mathematics, statistics, computer science and domain expertise. The significance of data science in today's era cannot be overstated. It has become the backbone of modern innovation, powering everything from recommendation systems on Netflix and fraud detection in banking to predictive maintenance in manufacturing industry. Organizations now realize that decisions made on intuition alone can no longer compete with those driven by data. As such, data scientists, the professionals who turn raw data into actionable insights, have emerged as a vital player across industries. The demand for data scientists has skyrocketed, and with good reason. They bring structure to unstructured data, find patterns that aren't obvious, and convert complex data sets into strategic business decisions. In the age of AI and automation, data science plays a central role, not only in feeding algorithms with clean structured data, but also in interpreting outcomes and ensuring ethical use of technology. However, becoming a proficient data scientist is not one step journey. It requires well-defined roadmap, a structured path that guides aspiring professionals through the foundational concepts to advanced skills. This roadmap blends theoretical knowledge with practical application. A well-outlined roadmap not only outlines the technical competencies but also emphasizes the development of soft skills such as critical thinking, storytelling with data and ethical considerations in data handling. Let's begin the journey into the world of data science where curiosity meets logic and insights drive impact. Now before we move on, just a quick info guys. You can boost your career with data science and Gen AI program by Simply Learn with Purdue University. This course is online. You will experience the excellence of Purdue's academic powers in data science and generative AI through this professional certification program. You're going to explore essential topics like Python, ML, deep learning, NLP, data visualization, generative AI, explainable AI, chat GPT, and much more. Upon completion of this program, you are going to get certificate from Purdue University and also you are going to access to Purdue's Alumni Association membership. The core curriculum is delivered in live online classes by industry experts and also you are going to get industry recognized IBM certificates for IBM courses. So guys, hurry up now and join the course. The course link is mentioned in the description box. Now before we move on, there is a short quiz to test your knowledge. Which of the following programming language is most commonly used in data science? And your options are, first one is Java, second one is Python, third one is HTML, and fourth one is C Sharp. Please mention your answers in the comment section below. Now before we move ahead with the session, I request you guys that do not forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon, so that you don't miss out any update from our end. So let's get started. So guys, let us first try to understand what is data science. Data science is all about making sense of information, sorting through loads of data and finding out interesting patterns and insights from it. It involves using maths, computer science and even human behavior to figure out what the data is telling us. An example of data science in action is when you see product recommendations on online shopping websites based on your previous purchases or search history. And this is done using data analysis and algorithms to predict what you might like to buy next, making your shopping experience more personalized. Moving forward, let's discuss some practical steps and strategies to crack data scientist role. First thing first, you need to understand the foundational concepts of data science. And this includes statistics, probability, linear algebra, and programming languages like Python or R. There are countless free and paid resources available online, from courses on Simply Learn to Simply Learn's YouTube tutorials. It's important to note that you can become an expert very quickly. But for that, you need to focus on building solid understanding of these concepts, and then you can move on to more advanced topics. Step two guys, build an amazing portfolio. 
One of the best ways to showcase your skills to potential employers is by building a portfolio. And this could include your personal projects, data analysis on real world data sets, or even Kaggle competition. The key here is to demonstrate your ability to apply what you have learned to real world problems. Don't worry if you don't have access to fancy data sets or tools. There are plenty of publicly available data sets on sites like Kaggle or even you can take the help of government websites. The important thing is to show your thought process, methodology and the insights you gain from the data. Now let us discuss about the step three that is getting certified. While certifications won't replace real world experience, but they can be a valuable addition to your resume. There are numerous data science certification available online, such as Google Data Analytics Certificates, the Data Scientist Master Program by Simply Learn, and many more. These certifications not only provide you with solid foundation, but also show potential employers your commitment to learning and showcasing that you are growing in this field. Now, let us discuss about the step four. Now, this is another great way to gain experience and build your network. So what you can do guys, you can participate in an internship or do some freelance projects. Look for opportunities in your local community, reach out to startups or non-profits and even consider offering your services for free initially. Believe me, it definitely helps to build your portfolio. Even if these experiences are unpaid, the knowledge and the connections you'll gain can be invaluable. Plus, you will have something concrete to add to your resume and portfolio. Now, let us discuss about step five. In the next step we have is networking. Now, networking is crucial in any field, but especially in data science, it could be helpful. You can attend meetups, connect with professionals on LinkedIn and engage in meaningful conversations. You never know when a connection could lead to an opportunity. And don't forget to leverage your existing network also. Reach out to professors, mentors, or anyone else who can provide advice and introductions. And finally, guys, do keep this in mind that data science is a rapidly evolving field. So it's important to stay up to date with latest tools, techniques, and trends. Subscribe to relevant blogs, join online communities, and guys, never stop learning. Remember, the journey to become a data scientist is not a sprint. It's a marathon. It may take time, effort and patience, but with the right mindset and determination, you can absolutely crack into this field. So guys, to sum it up, master the basics, build a portfolio, get certified, gain experience through internship and freelancing, and also never stop learning. And most importantly, believe in yourself and your abilities. And definitely, you'll be able to crack the data scientist role. Thank you guys for your time and I wish you best of luck on your journey to becoming a data scientist. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope so you would have enjoyed our today's video and do not forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon.